Are we in it to win it? <laughs> Every second counts. <laughs> God damn it. I'm wasting so much time. Dinner You're on that, the clock. That dumb show. Win it to win it. Oh no. Did we I'm talk about this last people. time? I thought we just started. Are we not starting? <laughs> Hold on. When are we starting? Okay. Um, hello. Start <laughs> are we started. No. We've started. Hi, everybody. Hi. Oh, just, <laughs> oh, you're going to make me start? <laughs> it's below oh, pro start. time. <laughs> yeah. We're here with Adam. It. <laughs> He's pretty much a member of Below Pro, so we've got the four Below Proies on the couch. That's right. Don't, don't the, repeat that ever. I was going to say, like, is this a surprise? Proey Below <laughs> Can we also just take a minute to appreciate the fanfic of Sailor Moon, Harry Potter, and uh, Dragon Ball Z with the Death Star in the background? Hold on. Why is she holding a gun? Because uh, she's cool. a dangerous lady. She is. That's Very a lot funny. of power. I love but a dangerous more lady. more importantly, a, radio a radioactive possum just bit you. What superpowers did you get? I don't know. Ree, what did ree, you get? Ree, ree. <laughs> yeah. um, <laughs> so, so Jason and I chose our names based off of this Oreo meme. Uh, uh, someone put up the Oreo meme. Probably Denny. <laughs> Here it is. Oreos. Um, <laughs> Sorry, that was me vomiting the Oreos up. <laughs> <laughs> I said tag yourself. So I was ree, ree, ree. Um, Future anyways, Denny pointed at one of the Oreos. That is me. Uh, anyways, Radio Active Possum. One of the Oreos, which is Katrina. And then point at one oh. of those, Adam and Jason. Oh, nice. Okay, <laughs> cool. I didn't know we were doing this right now. Um, okay, a radioactive possum just bit you. What superpower did you get? Uh, probably rabies. I'd go to the hospital immediately. Um, the incredible power of writing fan fiction so compelling that the actual characters of the TV shows <laughs> decide to go with any cra ideas and crazy ships. The superpower of always choosing the right combination of emojis to get the desired reaction from all people. <laughs> Seducing my loved ones, burning my enemies, settling in any argument, and even conveying complex emotional thoughts. Hmm. That could actually be very relevant in the modern day. Yeah, I kind of like that one. Out of the three of them, that's the most useful one. I feel like considering you just showed us an Oreo meme and named your character off of one, that the emoji one is Yeah, that's why I'm like, I, I like fitting. this one. Uh, emojis. Well, uh, and there's Oreo. Oreo. I'm gonna no, go with Ori the incredible power of writing fanfics. Oreo. <sighs> I was gonna do that too. <laughs> well, you can. There's four of us. Turkey two two. Uh, I'm turkey two two. If <laughs> turkey two two. <laughs> remembers from last time I was uh, doing Monster Pro. Uh, I'll write fan fiction too, as though I don't already. Here comes Tingo the Terror. <laughs> <laughs> I got rabies. Oh, <laughs> all right. <laughs> oh, sorry. That wasn't my choice. I was just making a statement. Oh, <laughs> That's like, I'm just joking with you. I actually have to go. Yeah, I just <laughs> my mom's I calling have, me. Um, um, which is the coolest? In the, oh. in the sink. Yeah, that's the. Which is the coolest mythological creature? Um, this weird creature I drew when I was six, <laughs> uh, and which is clearly super derivative from other mythological creatures, but super cool, and it's my OC and my spirit animal. Okay. <laughs> A sphinx who's super turned up and ready to party, and she wraps all her riddles. She still kills you if you don't answer them correctly, but she wraps the riddles. <laughs> the invisible hand of the free market. <laughs> wow. Invisible hand of the free market. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I really like good. the free market, but like I think I'm going to go with sphinx. Sphinx it is. Uh, I'm going to choose the free market. Uh, I'm going to go with the top one. Weird creature Sorry, I Donkey from six. Shrek just showed up on the computer on this side. And I'm, I don't know why. <laughs> what? He was just there to tell you he, he likes your boulder. <laughs> that's a nice boulder. That is, um, that's right. <laughs> Sorry, it's one of my Facebook chats. Anyway. Um, Love it. <laughs> it's one of my private groups. Yeah. Uh, I don't know why they made Donkey from Shrek the the picture of why the group. Why not? Um, I'll take the... I'll take the original character, the top one. Birds of a feather. Hey. So yeah. Your partner just gave you a cool gift for your anniversary, but you totally forgot. Quick, come up with an idea for a great gift. A silly toy that makes silly noises. A pony, always a pony. Anything capable of leading them to overdose of some sort. Oh, uh, the head of their fiercest enemy. Anything on fire or a weapon. No, no, a weapon on fire. The abstract concept of gratefulness. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah! Can you imagine you present someone with the abstract concept <laughs> of gratefulness on their anniversary? So now that I've played the game, I know who's who, which is 
Yes, yeah. that'll definitely help you. That does Amazing. help. And I um, swear I will not sabotage you this time around. I didn't mean to, I swear. <laughs> I'm sorry. Spoilers. <laughs> For the past series. <laughs> the past. Um, I'm going to go with a pony. Uh, a I Who do I want to... I'll go with the overdose. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't uh, even make it to prom. <laughs> That's right. Fiercest Guys. enemy. Ooh. You're going with your fiercest enemy? Yep. I will also take the fiercest enemy. Oh, no. Jace. Oh. Come on. Hell yeah. Really? Yeah. 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 We it, wait, you didn't realize that's who it was? I was curious. Ah. So yeah, normally Dave... anything to do with Vera has money involved. So. That's yeah. true. Let's do this. All right. Let's do this. Um... Let's Your name's see. like a uh, like a song that's like grinded to a halt. You're like, <laughs> ree, 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 ree. um, let's go to class. Class, it is. That day, you listen to your elders oh, and God. learn valuable lessons. Sometimes, after all the monster nonsense and the dating gimmicks, you forget that attending class is supposed to be the primary activity of this high school. You gain plus two smarts. Nice. Smart. You got it. No. Ah! <laughs> After your eavesdropping on Miranda and Polly, waiting for the perfect moment to mention your influx of Insta followers, when all right, who so, is this? Oh, <laughs> Katrina! You have not <laughs> right met off the beginning to get the interdimensional person. Okay. He looks so, like um uh, what's the robot in Undertale? Oh, um, um Metatron. He looks like what Metatron probably looks like oh, as that, a person. Anyways, very true. Um, <laughs> so we were talking amongst ourselves, and we want to try characters we haven't been before, except for Adam, who's pretty keen on Polly. No, no, I'm. I was kidding. <laughs> I'll do whatever. All right. Who's taking the interdimensional prince? Name off be- here, my lady. <laughs> you need not fight over me. <laughs> I've actually done all of these characters, so I think I'm out of this conversation. Him again. <laughs> <laughs> I've gotten her before, so. As royalty myself, I must say that even I find him to be... What's the term you used, Paulina? Extra AL. Friendship between two beautiful maidens shouldn't be soured over one as handsome, rich, and humble as I. But worry not, my sweet summer salads. Yes. <laughs> I forgot about sweet summer salads. That is a uh, That's pick-up disgusting. Wow. <laughs> that is something. I have found the perfect solution to protect your feeble hearts. You shall both marry me. Fire. I've dealt with man tournament before, but this is official <laughs> next level. Yes, on the interdimensional level, as our collective <laughs> wedding will be as well. Yeah, not interested. You are hardly the first prince to make to seek my royal hand in courtship, and I don't see that you're bringing much to the table. Interdimensional <laughs> table! <laughs> and I'm the definition of marriage material! <laughs> <laughs> You'll never find a better sweeter. <laughs> I have a castle! <laughs> I can defeat anyone at anything. I'll show you. I'll fight. Ha! Ah. Who is this? This no is the interdimensional this prince. This is the interdimensional prince. <laughs> oh, pointing um, directly at you. Okay. That's right. Why is your life like this? I don't okay. fucking know. We just jumped right into this. I can defeat you at any oh, challenge. God. Name your weapon and prepare to lose. Miranda and Polly are watching you closely. Maybe you can skew the prince's challenge to really impress one of them. You know what would be wild? Naked fencing with the weasels instead of swords. As a royal, you must fancy yourself pretty clever, so let's see you win at losing. I mean... Ooh. 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 Who are you going for, Katrina? Polly or Miranda? Miranda, so the bottom. Ooh, is that what you think? Wait, shit, I don't know. Ooh, here comes the <laughs> sabotage that I said it was hey! going to <laughs> Donkey's back. All right, I'm going to let you. <laughs> Donkey! <laughs> Don- right, to make, make your choice. I will not input whatsoever. Oh, God. Oh. <sighs> I'm gonna. I'm still gonna go with the bottom. That's what my gut told me to do. So All right. it, it's probably gonna be a bad ah, shit. Oh, not so creative. About your stats, girl. Royalty ah. is very clever. I know because I'm royalty. Very well then. Let us proceed with the challenge rules. A series of trials begin. You each post selfies to Instagram. The prince instantly gains twelve followers while you lose ten. Oh no! <laughs> That's real. <laughs> Round one goes to the home team. It would appear. Sorry about your unfortunate face. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> wow, fuck. 
Uh, next up are classic feats of athleticism. The prince kicks your ass and uh, up and down in archery, fencing, and bumper cars. Oof. That's athleticism. <laughs> Finally, you engage in a stirring round of Monopoly. Ooh. <laughs> the prince wins within six moves. What did he do? Six Hop moves? across the table and just take the money from you? Probably. I mean, I give up in six moves, but... <laughs> <laughs> I don't even like Monopoly. <laughs> exactly. <I> <laughs> Aha! Normally, Monopoly might last days, <laughs> but I, with my incredible skills, have managed to win it once, because I am a winner! Now, surely, I have proven myself a worthy and winning group for both my bloody brides! <laughs> Sorry? <laughs> yes, I believe you really, truly have. Yeah, I know that technically the point was for you to lose, but losing <laughs> is a pretty big turnoff. Winning really is much more appealing. I'll go ask my father his policies on poly polyamory. <laughs> <laughs> hey, oh, nice. cool. You can trust Miranda's father to put the shit the, <laughs> that on allowing his daughter to marry the same prince as a coked out ghost. But you still look pretty dumb. Damn it. Well, I mean, you did win some favor with Miranda, though. Yeah, yeah you got you some favor got with Miranda. Yeah, that's but... why I was surprised, but then I lost shit. So I'm like, I oh, agree. Well. I'm also surprised. <laughs> Actually, let's let's take a look at these stats here. Yeah. Hurry. Uh, oh, gosh. That's <laughs> a lot of force. Yeah, it is a lot of force. Oh, yeah, Adam, you got a lot of force. He's, he's blue again. I'm not fun or bold. Jason. God damn it. Uh, I'm going to... I'm go smart again. I guess I'm going to go outdoors. <clears throat> Let's that move. day during recess, you start a half-hour rave that goes full crazy. You have no idea how it escalates so much, but at one point, there are like 300 people. Someone summons a demon from a nightmare dimension. The consequences might distort the fabric of reality itself, but who cares? It's a rad party. I get too fun. Woo! Eh, yes. Nice. Scott and Polly pull you aside, one of them uh, holding each of your arms. Whatever's going on, it's serious. I think I'm going to be Scott this time, if you guys are okay yeah, with that. Yeah, sure. yeah, take him. We need your help, bruh. <laughs> the midterm for AP jump scares is coming up tomorrow, and we're so unprepared. We tried everything we could think of to get ready. I rolled up the textbook and smoked it. And I ate my homework. But nothing worked. We only got one option left. We got to cheat, bruh. We just need to figure out to do it without, with the, without messing with the teacher. Or messing with the teacher, either way. If you could help us, we'd be so per grateful. That's all the incentive you need. You hook them up with the ultimate cheating technique. Uh, taking the test like normal than using a time machine. Write all the answers on the teacher's face. <laughs> uh, that's, that's awesome. I'm not bold enough to write the answers on the teacher's <laughs> face. That's unfortunate because I think that's the poly. Actually, I think we had this on the last. Yeah, we did. We did. I had this one. Um, Maybe you'll still win favor with Polly if you go for the second one. Uh, I don't know. I want to get stats because <laughs> I don't know. Maybe you'll end up with the Ryan curse. That's like the you'll, thing, you'll right? just be diverted into a Scott plot line <laughs> <laughs> every time. Okay, I'm gonna try the time machine because I don't think I can do teacher's face. Yeah, oh, nice. ah, so smart. See, I told you Oribio would have a time machine. <laughs> <laughs> Polly reluctantly hands Scott $5. Nice. <clears throat> Damn, Scott, you are really good at guessing when people have time machines. I guess you just got an incredible sense of <laughs> timing. <laughs> now, come on, let's grab this time machine and go screw up. <laughs> what? Causality. Oh, causality. <laughs> I know, I messed up on the reading of like, that, too. What? <laughs> just don't see it coming. Ah, lo Scott loves you. Scott loves me so much. <laughs> Uh, you're going to use the time machine to kill Monster Hitler, but this seems about as important. You gain two boldness and a fun. Nice. There we go. Now I have some stats. Right, Turkey, Turkey two. Tuesday. Uh, <laughs> Turkey. <laughs> I guess we're going to the bathroom to get some boldness. Boldness it is. Yeah. <laughs> that day you skip class and just hang out in the bathrooms because you respect no authority. I guess some people just want to watch the world burn by skipping class and hanging out in the bathrooms. You give zero shits, <laughs> but you gain plus two boldness. Hmm. Zero shits in the bathroom. Sounds fake, but okay. You spy Vera and Liam engaging in their favorite <laughs> pastime, a variation of people watching called monster judging. <laughs> All right. So. I oh, I'll take not, Liam. I have not played Vera yet. 
Do it. You Do go, it. man. You go. All right. Now I got to <laughs> freaking know what I'm doing. Oh, do you see what she's wearing? <laughs> Newsflash, lime green stripper boots. Do not go with Chupacabra for her. At least she made a choice. I've seen six people wearing the same Air Gordon sneakers. We really are the lucky ones, Liam. Most people are just absolutely hideous. But even their hideous is mediocre. Most people are hideous, but I have yet to see one that is most hideous. <laughs> I wonder what such an abomination would even look like. Ooh. True hideousness is on the inside. In your organs. A person oh. with their organs on their outside <laughs> would be the most hideous. <laughs> I like the body. reasoning. Symmetrical face. Nice features. Because traditional beauty standards are hideously mainstream. Oh, Jesus. The first one. <laughs> the first one? Yep. This one it is. So creative. Ah, yes. I've always said that a person's insides could be even worse than their shell. Ew. A passing hermit crab dragon hybrid glares at her, but Vera doesn't seem to care. <laughs> I mean, unkept eyebrows are gross enough, but an unkept esophagus? The mind reels. Oh my god. <laughs> I will admit, as repulsive as I find most people, it would be hard for me to ignore an exposed circulatory system. <laughs> I haven't settled on a voice for him. It keeps changing. That's yeah, okay. My Figure it out. Voice is, is fluid. And there's nothing more hideous than looking than what? than being drawn to repulsive people just because they're thirsty. Mm, I can relate. I've seen Polly drawn to me. It is some... Sorry. Uh, I've seen Polly <laughs> drawn to some... It t repulsive low lives herself when she's... thirsty. <laughs> <laughs> I like that joke. It's funny. Of course, that's a different kind of thirst, but the principle certainly holds. Nice. Ah, the innocent joy of bonding over mutual... Derision? Yes, yep. that's an R. Of the appreciate appearances of others, you gain plus two fun and plus one creativity. Nice. He's Hi, back in the game. Tinko the Tear. All right. Tinko the Tear wants to go to the auditorium. Auditorium it is. Yeah. That day, while Damn rehearsing it. for the class play, it just all <laughs> the muses themselves that descended to give you a figurative blue job. Oh. Your performance is intense and expiring. Uh, expiring? It will be remembered for generations, <laughs> which is pretty rad by high school play standards. You gain two creativity. I'm Later, honest. you hear Vera and Liam <laughs> in a heated conversation, which seems to contain some pretty sexually explicit language. So naturally, you gotta eavesdrop. Oh, these two guys again. <laughs> Speaking as a male, I can say that even I grow weary of the infantilizing monotony of the male gaze. <laughs> Thank you. See, I want to advocate for the Gorgon gaze instead, but that would just turn people rock hard, winky <laughs> face. <laughs> That's not an erection joke, Jason. People would die. <laughs> <laughs> Personally, I think hentai is the source of the problem. It's so unrealistic. Hello. I'm not a 2D drawing. I'm a real vampire. Oh, meta jokes. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Even I can't keep up with the standards hentai is setting. What? I'm supposed to just grow a dick during sex? Yes. What the hell's happening? And all the women are drawn exactly the same. There's even less body type diversity than at this school. Plus, I don't think anyone in real life has ever willingly addressed a tentacle as senpai. <laughs> and that's with all the tentacles anyways. Oh, and well, never mind. Ridiculous. Because half the studio heads are Krakens, Liam. And no tea, no shade to the women who do enjoy tentacle porn. I know at least three of my snakes do, but I won't out them. <laughs> but I do think there should be a more diverse offering for those of us who'd like something less... Excuse me? <laughs> How do? Cephalosexual. Cephalosexual. Now. <laughs> Can Definition. you use it in a sentence? Um, Can you use it as a cephalosexual question mark? Agreed? <laughs> Period. I swear I yeah. am not a cephalosexual. I think that's the only Wait, I need that to, I want to Google that. With a question mark. Hey right. Siri, uh, g define cephalosexual. Well, it's just you're, you're sexually attracted <laughs> to invertebrates. Define cephalosexual. She heard supple asexual. Oh, why'd she throw supple in there? <laughs> I didn't throw supple in there. Supple. Oh, yes. Seppa. Oh. Their tentacles oh, are supple. Yeah, my, I think my Vera voice is just, like, ASMR. I found this on the web for Define Cephalosexual. Cephalosexual. 
Oh, she didn't actually tell me. Agree. That's not a thing. It's not a real word. Okay, yeah. It's, it's, just yeah, it's okay, probably it's not a real thing. Damn it, I wanted it to be real. Because it's like cephalopods, right? Yeah. yeah. Hinti should be more artistic. Henty? Redraw explicit scenes in the style of great artists such as Picasso or Magritte. Don't send a misogynistic Kraken to do a Fem Gorgon's job. You should open your own hentai <laughs> studio. Oh, yeah. I don't know if I'm a wrestler or a pirate. <laughs> Um, <laughs> I, well, we're going to do the second one. The second one? Yeah. All right. I don't know if I've got the stats for it. I'm Ooh. not so... Oh, so now because I'm a woman who wants better for herself, it's up to me to handle things. Uh-oh. I have plenty of shit of my own to worry about without heading up a hentai studio. Oof. I'll have you know I'm a straight-A student, and that's only partially thanks to bribery. The rest is hard work and extortion. <laughs> <laughs> And what does Vera know about production, anyhow? <laughs> I'm getting some, like, cowboy vibes all of a sudden, so surely she would be in a far above her abilities as she has no experience. I love that shit-eating grin. It's like, <laughs> I know about hentai, that's for sure. <laughs> oh, 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 Liam absolutely knows about hentai. Yeah, yep. uh, like an expert no <clears throat> over here. That is, did you not hear her? She has more important things to do. <laughs> the two of them storm off huddily to continue their deep discussion about pornography somewhere free of stupidity. <laughs> you lose two smarts and one charm. Pornography. All right, it's what's time. the question? Everybody choose Everybody the, brand. the brand. Oh. I I don't know brands. Um like Levi's. Levi's. Yeah, we're gonna go classic jeans. Blue yeah, that's jeans. a that's a classic. The brand. working man's pant. Oh, no name. Wow, that is a brand. That's a brand. That's a brand. brand. Yep. <clears throat> I guess I'll go Kellogg's. <laughs> <laughs> I guess. Yes. Yeah. I, I guess I have to. I now. have to. I mean, nobody else <laughs> chose it. Those are the only three brands. I guess I'm out. <laughs> yeah. Feels like um, it sometimes. I mean, you chose the other two, so. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Damn it! I'm trying to think. Like, um, I guess. Uh, Yamaha. <laughs> yeah, that's nice. That's an old thing, right? Like the motorcycles or the drums? No, like the no, sleds. It's the brand. It's the brand. It's all yeah. sleds. It's, yeah. the, it's all of the Wait, they do all sleds. of that? Yeah, they do yeah. like so many things. Oh my god. Yeah. Okay. Okay. It's like, TVs it's like no well name. Oh yeah, I guess so. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Kirkland Signature. Player order has decided on how funny and crazy it would be if the selected brand teamed <laughs> up with a popular <laughs> K-pop group <laughs> that starred in all their ads. No name. Uh, <laughs> fucking uh, damn it. I Yamaha like, makes instruments. Yeah, Yamaha kind of makes sense, actually. Yamaha Eli loses. Damn clothes. it. I think... I, no. know, I feel like I would be third and Tinko would be fourth. Yeah. yeah. What, did, what was your choice again? Mine was Levi's. Oh, Levi's. yeah, they would. That's they would fashion clothes. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Like it'd be. Yeah, pretty I agree. standard. <laughs> now let's talk about Kellogg's. <laughs> <laughs> let's not. <laughs> because if a K-pop band is eating the cereal, they can't be singing, <laughs> <laughs> or they're singing with cereal in their hands. I mean, No Name's pretty funny though. No Name is specifically because it's like a Canadian brand too. Like it's it's just. Plain, I, boring, yellow. I think no sad. name would be, would no be first. No frills. Yeah, I'm going to agree that no name is first. Yeah. Oh, so it's the exact it's same actually, turn order we had. It's in that order. Oh, yeah, yeah, it is. Look at that. All right, That's well. how the Oreo crumbles. Well, that wasn't that just a great first round. Really? <sighs> my life. You know it's what? It's my, my life. life Next time on Below Pro. Never. We're gonna play this game for real. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, this round's gonna be real. I have to go to school tomorrow. It's too <laughs> bad. I graduated already. Uh, bye. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye bye. I'd like to see No Name as the next fighter in Mortal Kombat. <laughs> I'd like to see No Name join the battle in <laughs> no Smash <name>. Ultimate. <laughs> it's no like Name yellow joins can. the battle. <laughs> they said every character. <laughs> They're all no, here. <laughs> no Name eliminates the competition. Oh, you know how they like those fake cans where you take off the lineage of snakes? That's one oh of the moves. Oh my god. That's your awesome. side B. That's a great move. Anyways, bye. <laughs>